Um, what we want to do is now take you to Switzerland, um, where we're working on a project. And again, this is the power of this project, is that we can take you, everyone in this room, to this job, and you can have an informed conversation. The client gave us uh, a, a sketch up like this. This is all around community consultation. Um, this is something that Rico and his, uh, his dad helped us um, get together, so I'll let Rico yep. quickly explain it. So I'll, I'll just walk out here, be just because I can, I guess. Um, this is a development on an old expo site in Biel in Switzerland. So at the moment it's a nasty gravel car park, um, but quite sensitive because it's, it's, a, it's a beautiful um, foreshore really. I mean, there's not many spaces in Switzerland on the lake that you can still develop. Um, but the community is currently sort of crowdfunding an anti-campaign for this, trying to stop this um, development. The developer in this case um, wants to show the public what the amenities will be that they bring with this development. Beach, beach volley, stages to watch soccer games, all of these things. Um, so among having the design tool, which you've seen um, before, where you can go around, measure, take snapshots, this is um, like a demo mode now. Um, so that's for people in the community to actually use themselves or someone guide them through it. Um, and part in the German, but Schloss means castle, Bahnhof means train station. These are the two um, locations where this is presented. If we just start at the castle, um, it's a predetermined pathway now from this um, castle that looks somewhat like the one that um, they would be used to. And currently I can just sort of use my game controller to look around, get an impression for the area, and this serves for people as a point of recognition. We're currently here, let's fly to this starting point that we're arriving at right now. Now looking at this, more than life sites really, um, we can simply walk through this entire development and have a look at what that means on the ground and also um, access a number of hotspots. So let's say go to this swimming jetty down here and just fast track to some of the more interesting aspects of the site. Um, now the, the change, this is not about selling someone anything. It's not um, gonna sell you an apartment, but nevertheless the same new rules apply is that rather than showing you a chip rock model of this and the plan and a couple of beautiful perspectives, if I give you this controller now that you walk through, you don't feel like I'm trying to sort of <coughs> teach you or sell you anything. You're actually exploring this space and you're, you're making up your own mind. And this is part of the um, larger story of these interactive um, environments. It's not just in the design process understanding something, because most people in that process, they know what they're doing, but it's really giving the edge to that communication to people that don't know what they're doing. In this case, like me, um, I would not get an impression like this from this plan. I just wouldn't. Um, just for lack of experience. And yet what's interesting is that they're the very people that the, I guess from a community consultation point of view, they're trying to get feedback from. And so it's just, it's just, it's incredible how it's changing that journey.